The new facility was constructed over the past 17 months at Plantation Diamond, East Bank de Marara, to the tune of more than $1 billion. At a commissioning ceremony, General Manager of DSL, Brian Pretty Paul, explained that the company's success as a leading distributor of consumer goods in the country has pushed the need for such a massive distribution warehouse. DSL has also diversified into retail, and today we currently operate four cash and carry stores across Guyana. The distribution business currently reaches a total of 2,300 retailers in Guyana through our effective sales force and strong distribution network. However, these efforts have been stemmed in to an extent as the rapid growth of DSL resulted in constraints to our existing warehouse space. And this provided a key justification to develop this state-of-the-art warehouse facility. Meanwhile, chairman of the DDL group noted that the construction of this warehouse is part of a much larger expansion, multi-million program the company has undertaken to do. We have completed and commissioned in April a new warehouse for aging 30,000 barrels of rum to support our international brand development. We have several projects at various stages of implementation. And not too far from here, we are building a new modern blending plant, um, which is scheduled for completion later this year. We are in the middle of a modernization of Demerara shipping port and office facilities at Water and Schumacher Streets in Georgetown. And we are, are commencing a major expansion of our TAPCO operation, an expansion which I think brings very interesting linkages to the agriculture sector in Guyana. On the other hand, Finance Minister Winston Jordan lauded the expansion the company has undertaken over the years, noting that these investments are a testament of the confidence investors have in Guyana. This investment is evidence of the improvement in the investment climate in Guyana. This is one of several large investments that are taking place in the economy and it's an indicator of how confident private businesses are about the state of our economy. We have managed to keep the economy growing in an increasingly hostile international environment such as de-risking AML CFT, which is posing more problems for businesses and for people to do businesses, and a domestic environment that is sometimes wracked by political instability and challenges to our traditional sectors. The new distribution warehouse is approximately 43,000 square foot and it is outfitted with modern storage facilities and capabilities to store both frozen and chilled goods. For the evening news, Yanala Dalrymple.